word. Okay. Um, so, um, it's interesting how many students misspell this. Um, what kind of mistake do you think they make? Um, very often the mistake is that they only have one N in the middle uh, of beginning. Okay. Um, sometimes I've seen students put a double G in, but I think that's just because they think to themselves uh, there's a double letter somewhere. So, but really, the, the main error is that they only put one N. So, uh, what can we do about this? Um, I like to be very explicit about this pattern. Um, and uh, let's have a look at that together. It's something that we can help them to work out. Um, if we look at this word, uh, we've got, um, we've, we start with the word begin. OK. And uh, here we've got, at the end of the word, we've got the pattern consonant, vowel, consonant. All right. And that is stressed. And that's important because if the stress was at the beginning of the word, then we would not double the final consonant. But here we do. So um, I like to show my students that uh, there is a pattern here, and which I've just put on the slide. Um, so if we've got a consonant, vowel, consonant at the end of the word that's stressed, then we usually double the final consonant before we add ing and some other suffix. 